already packed and we got a Ford Ranger coming because I got so much junk. Oh, yeah. I think Adam's here. Come out to Big C to buy some stuff for the new place. Easy. This is for you, mate, over here. You don't want to just move to a retirement village, I think. That'll do you well. Definitely have to get some cleaning supplies because the place that I moved in, it hasn't been cleaned. Lots of cleaning products. Lots of them. Two new pillows. Definitely need new window curtains. Shower curtain. Oh, is it, is I rate that. Yeah, I'll put in my own curtain. All that stuff came to 2,499 baht. Right, time to do a bit of cleaning. I promised myself I wouldn't help you move again, but here we are. To get rid of that disgusting old shower curtain. A nice new freshie. <laughs> it's a tall shower curtain. Oh! Do you guys know Dave and Dee? Bad Q Minaro? We, we have a shirt right here at Bowling. Catching up for a beer in John Dien's. Bad Q Garage, I always do that. Deliveries from Lazada arrived. Some goodies for home decorating. Bedside lamps. Cause you know how dark it's been in here. I may take my cleaning a little bit too seriously, but fucking sticky shit off with a blade. One essential thing when you move into a new place, especially an old place. That's what we like. That's freshy. Okay, ladies and gents, it's time to uh, do a few touch-ups in the bathroom. Casey, you seem to be pretty good at spacking doors. Have you had some experience with this before, mate? Uh, it's a common thing in Thailand to have <laughs> one's door. But I'm a firm believer in white paint. Making a room look as large as possible, even if it's not large at all. I'll tell you what, this building was built late 80s, early 90s. So that means this door had what I would say is about 30 years of handprints and grease and muck and grime on it. This is the 1960s-esque lime green kitchenette. Now you can see it's very old, the water has got into the wood. I just can't handle the green colour. What I did is order some sticky vinyl off Lazada and you can see I've cut out squares and put it there, there. So basically I'm going to turn it into a newer looking black kitchen. I've got these waterproof Sort of foam like tiles, mock tiles. And there's a lot of water damage at the back of this vanity. Peel off the sticky layer and then place it on, and it should look like a brand new splashback. Go in there like so. We'll remove this microwave temporarily. This I cannot abide. Yes. I am very happy with that. Okay, so my bedside table's finally arrived, but what I'm actually doing, because I'm a bloody idiot, I went to Mist nightclub all night last night and I lost my wallet there. So let's head back to Mist and see if we can find that wallet. I don't know, we might have some luck. I think we found it. Sweet success, got it back. All money, cards in there, yay! I love Thailand. So I'm in a hardware store 
and it's about 15 minutes to close. Heaps of other people in there as well. And I've packed like a massive basket with all stuff I need for the house, hooks, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. 10 minutes before close, they close the computers and no one can pay for their stuff. And we all have to leave our baskets there for tomorrow. <laughs> Standard, right? And now we've sorted that wallet rubbish, I can hook into putting together my new bedside tables. Wacky do! My God, what a beautiful day it is. Cheesy's down here early. He's found this new skate park he loves. So I'm gonna go down, meet him for lunch, have a little break from home renovation. Okay, that's that. Did a bit of drone with Adam skating in the background. I'm gonna head down to the hardware store now and pick up yesterday's basket that they wouldn't let me buy because they wanted to leave early. <laughs> Sweet success, got all my stuff, it's still there. I won't say the name of the place, great place, amazing homeware stock, interesting stuff. Ah, a shower caddy, masking tape, hooks, stapler, air freshener, super glue, cockroach killer, cockroach killer, and that blue stuff you put in the toilet to make the water look pretty. God, I fucking hate flat packs. It looks really legal, but <laughs> it's not what we're doing. Not this time. 